the Earth's movements are classified into two groups. Forces generally internally from within the Earth are called endogenic forces. Earthquakes and volcanoes are the result of endogenic forces. Exogenic forces generated on the surface of the Earth are external forces. Endogenic forces are of two types, sudden and diastrophic. Earthquakes, volcanoes and landslides are types of sudden endogenic forces. The formation of mountains and other landforms is the result of diastrophic endogenic forces. Exogenic forces includes weathering, erosional and depositional, glaciers, rivers, wind and sea waves are agents of erosion and deposition. Join us today and transform the way you learn with Notebook.